we work with what we have in the wild. That looks great. So Shandy, you're drizzling the oil over our tomatoes, huh? Yes, these are beautiful tomatoes we have here. What else are we adding to them? We're adding okay. some chives, rough tearing of chives. <laughs> and then we're gonna add some herb butter. Oh, that sounds amazing. And these are our delicious side dishes. We have some onions um, with some herb butter, some zucchini, um, asparagus with orange slices and we are using the seasoning that we're going to put on everything. Wow, that looks fantastic. Well, let's see, we've got our coals working here. They're almost there. Look at that. Okay, Shandy, what are we doing now? So now we have the steaks out. We have some organic um, steaks that we got. And then just drizzling some olive oil, um, our trusty seasoning, and then a little bit of this herb butter. And then we're gonna throw it right on the grill like that. Those farms around here are just like the best meat. Yeah, they're amazing. It's all grass fed. Yeah. As it should be. So we finished up our steak. So we have the seasoning and the herb butter. We're gonna just throw them on the grill like that. A nice piece of fat on there. Yeah, they're gonna yeah. be delicious. Look at that fat. So I'm gonna get our steaks that you graciously prepared, Shandy. And I'm gonna take them to the grill and we're just gonna throw them directly on top. Hear that I know, they're already cooking. God, they already smell good. I love this herb butter. All right, we'll let those cook for a few minutes and then we'll uh, throw the veggies on. Wow, these steaks are coming out amazingly. That's really oh, yeah. That's going to be fantastic. Wow. Look at those grill marks. Smell that. Mm. Cooking in the wild. Got to love it. Those look so delicious. Wow. That fat's really cooking off nicely, crispy. A lot of heat in that barbecue. Yeah, that's amazing. Okay, let's get the veggies on. Okay, so go ahead and put the onions up here. And the steaks are done. Or as done as I want them done. God, that looks good. And then I'll throw the rest of the vegetables on there as well. What are you putting on? Okay, I've asparagus. got our asparagus, and then we have our onions, and... Zucchini, I believe, that one is. This is the zucchini, and then I've got the tomatoes over here, too. Those tomatoes were Actually, chives. this is the asparagus. Oh, oh yes. <laughs> I don't know. We wrapped them up. I'm not sure which one was which. I gotta seal this up a little bit more there. Okay. That looks good. Yeah, I think that all the aluminum foil will help hold the heat in. 
Does that crackle? Yep, pretty much. The potatoes are looking good. The meat? Oh yeah, for sure. Oh yeah, the meat's pretty good. Does that crackle? Yep, pretty much. The potatoes are looking good. Okay, all this stuff is cooked up. Get the onions off here. Break it through the foil. And I'm just gonna stack all of this on top. Let me check. We got the tomatoes. The zucchini. And last but not least our asparagus. And the asparagus is a little bit thicker, so it got steamed, but it's not going to be as well done as the other vegetables. But it'll be perfect. It'll be a little al dente, though. Okay, let's take it over with our steaks, and we'll be ready to serve this stuff. All right, let's set this here. Let's grab our potatoes to you. Set directly into the coals. like popcorn. <laughs> and there we go. So let's serve this. All right, and that's our outdoor cooking for today. And we have our potatoes, our asparagus with a little bit of citrus. And then we have our onions, our tomatoes, zucchini, and finally our steaks. For now, I'm Joey, the quarantine cook, and we'll see you next time. And Shandy, I want to thank you for helping me out today and enjoying this area with us. This has been a great trip.